Hello and welcome to the R tutorial by State Modeler. In this video, we are going to see how can we install R and R Studio in our system. So let's get started. Go to google.com. There you need to search download R. Please remember, first of all, you need to install R then R Studio. So first of all, we are going to download R and install it and then we'll go for the R Studio. Here you will see first link which is cran.r-project.org. Click on that. The latest version of R is 4.0.0. So you can click on the download R 4.0.0 for Windows because my system is for because my system is Windows system. So I'll be downloading this and it is used in both the system 32 bit or the 64 bit. So let me click on that. It is of 83.5 MBs. So it may take a time. So R is downloaded now. Meanwhile, I've also in downloaded this R Studio, but I'll show you how to download it. So first of all, let us install this R. So let me click on that. It will ask to run the file. So let us click on the run. Click on the yes. Select the language that you want to install into it. So let me keep it by default English and click OK. Click on the next. It will ask you for the path of the installation. So by default, it will be installed in C drive and program files. The R folder will be there in that this version will be installed. If you want to change this, then you can click on the browse and change the location. But let me keep it by default and click next. So what are the setup that you want to install into it? So let us keep it by default and click next. Again, let us keep it by default and then click next. Next. If you want to add shortcut to your desktop, at that time you can click on this and then click on the next. Installation is started. It may take some time. Once it is done, you can click on the finish. Let us download and install R Studio as well. So you need to go to the google.com. There you need to search R Studio. And here you'll see the first link from rstudio.com. Just click on that. Just scroll it down. You'll find all the options which are available for the R Studio. So R Studio Desktop, R Studio Desktop Commercial License, R Studio Server, which is available for free, R Studio Server Pro, with the packages which is available for free as well as commercial license. So we are going to select this R Studio Desktop, which is available for free. Click on the download and it will take you to the download link. And here it is also asking you to install R first. So R Studio is required minimum R 3.0.1 plus version. So we have already installed R 4.0.0. So here you can click on the download R Studio for Windows. The version of R Studio is 1.2.5042 and its setup size is 149.84 MB. Let me just click on that. It has started downloading it, but I already in downloaded this. So I'm just canceling it and click on the already downloaded file. Just wait for a few seconds. It may take time. Don't click multiple times. So here it is asking for the permission. So let us click on the yes. It has started the installing process. So click on the next. Then again, it is asking for the a destination path where R Studio will be installed. So it is by default in C drive program files in R Studio. It will require 777.5 MBs of space. So let us click on next. Then click on the install. It has started installing the R Studio. Once the installation is completed, you can click on the finish. So once it is installed, you can go to the start menu, then you can click on the all programs. You can just go to this R Studio, click on that and there R Studio will be there. If your system is Windows 10 or something else, then you can just search in the start menu, then you will find this program. So once you open this, it will be open like this. You can see without any error, it is installed and now it is working. You can click on the new file to create a new R script and write down your program. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel to get this kind of informative video. You can also comment which video you want to see next from our side. Thank you. Thank you so much.